Hey everybody, my name is Tyler Watson. This is Tour Time with Tyler and welcome to the canyons. Let's take a look at this model. So this is the Gemini. Get you up so you can see the whole thing. Sorry, I can't really back up. There's a fence right behind me. But this is five bed, four bath, three car garage. It's 3,628 square feet. Right now they have two currently available. They're starting just a hair under 680,000. Before we head on up, I just want to show you how pretty that is up here. We're right here in Southern Henderson. So you can see a view of everything. Really neat area. Also, if you could do me a huge favor, like, subscribe, and share. It really helps me out. I really enjoy making these movies. Also, I have a free MLS app where you could download it. It works just like Zillow, realtor.com, except the info will come even before they get it. But back to the home. So you have a courtyard right here, actually very nice size. All of the homes will come with this. This home has one of the higher elevations with the stonework. Nice even texture on the stucco. Now with this home, you will get a ring doorbell included. It's always nice to see and have. But coming on in. So nice, large opens. I just don't want the door to slam, the deadbolt's open. Before we head in, right here is a three car garage. You have two side by side and one tandem that will extend back towards the living room. Now the floor in here is not the standard flooring. This is upgraded. There are only a few things that are upgraded in this home and I'll point them out to you. In here they have the two-tone paint. They, don't, they no longer offer that. You will get it in white. You get the orange peel texture. The ceilings are about 10 feet. So right off the bat, you have a three quarter bath downstairs. Right here you have a bunch of cabinetry. So the downstairs bathroom, it has the fiberglass shower, which is nice. There's a separate room right here that you could use as a potential suite. You get the 36 inch counters in here and everywhere else you'll see cabinetry. They're gonna be the same that's in the kitchen. Really like this flooring. So here's the downstairs bedroom. And like I said, if you have guests or you have someone that just can't go up and downstairs, it's a nice option. It's a decent sized bedroom actually. Come around. How cool is this? I love this model. All of the chandeliers, the artwork, it's really kind of fun and fresh. So you have your three door sliding closet. Again, all of this storage will come standard. These are the upgraded cabinets. When you upgrade the cabinets, you don't get the basic banister. You get this more modern looking one with the metal inserts. But how cool is this kitchen? Huge. Just want to give you a second so you can see it all. Your dining area. I want to swing around into your living area. Again, neat chandeliers. I really like how they spec to this. So again, the flooring is upgraded. But I love how they designed everything in here. Love the flow, it's just nice and open. So, the standard fridge will be just slightly different than this. It will be just like this as far as size. Love how big these are. Wouldn't have to go out and buy a, a freezer right now with the uh, pandemic going on. The backsplash is an option, upgrade. 
and a huge, huge island. Really like this quartz top that they have on it. Really like the contrast. So right here is your pantry. And it is large. Again, you can survive a world war. Wouldn't have to be running out to the stores right now. So you have your stainless steel double stack oven. Microwave. Again, the backsplash is an upgrade. Let's check out the cabinets. So with the optional cabinets, you do get the hardware on them. These are not soft closing. You just get the little bumper on them. Here is your five burner range. And a really neat vent hood. You swing it across. I just, I love this feature in these houses. So this it may look like a second dishwasher. It is actually an ice fridge, an ice freezer. So again, it kind of closed softly, but uh, not true soft close. You will get the stainless steel undermounted sink with the faucet. And then this right here, this is your reverse osmosis filter. There's a filter under the sink and you will get bottled quality drinking water from that. Your dishwasher. And then this is a big, big dining area. I mean, this table looks tiny in here. Again, how cool are these lighting fixtures? I'll save the backyard. So right here, this is your storage room under the stairs. A lot of people like to call it your Harry Potter room. It's also your coat, uh, excuse me, coat closet. And as you can see, it goes all the way down and around. Won't bother taking us on a uh, little adventure. Let's head on upstairs. But just so you can see how high it is. Ceilings in here are really nice and high. Again, just so you can see the upgraded railing and banister. So with this, you come out right at the loft. Nice big, big slider. Again, if you wanted to do this a little bit more informal, kind of like what they did, more of a game room, fun room, hangout room, totally an option. Keep downstairs a little bit more formal. We have the master just down this way, but before we do, I'm going to show you the other rooms and bedroom. Again, more storage, same cabinets as down below. Right here is your laundry room, and it is big. You will get all the cabinets, you will get the sink. You will not get that washer and dryer. They just put them in here for display. But when you take ownership of the home, you'll either need to purchase them or you can purchase them through the builder into the first of the bedrooms. Really nice size room. This is a master bedroom in some homes. So it's en suite, it has its own bathroom before we head in there, just so you can see the walk-in closet. It's, uh, it's decent size, I mean, for a secondary bedroom, it's definitely large. This bathroom has a three-quarter shower. Again, as always, just the fiberglass. You can option up and choose for stone if you want. 36 inch counter height sink and vanity, your toilet. I'm gonna swing around just so you can see how big this room is. And then upstairs, the ceilings are nine feet tall. So not quite as tall as downstairs, but still higher than most homes. 
into the next bedroom. So it has a little bump out right here. They just didn't bring the closet all the way so that you could open the door. Decent sized bedroom, very standard. So you have a two door closet. Straight across from here, you have the upstairs bathroom. This will be the one that these two bedrooms will share and also the loft. And you have your standard insert fiberglass, tub shower combo, and then your toilet. You replace the light here, it's getting a little dark. Into the other bedroom. Again, I really like how they laid all of this out, who I respect the actual model. This one's fun. So right here is your walk-in closet. And for a smaller bedroom, it's pretty big. It's almost uh, probably eight or nine feet long. I like the setup, the neat art. And let's take it into the master. Again, with the chandeliers, it's fun. So very, very nice size master. As you can see, they have two lounge chairs in here that still fit a nice size bed. This is a big room. You have your little sitting area, you have your bed. Coming into the master bath. And again, I love these baths here. So you have separate sinks. They're a little higher than you have your makeup vanity area to get ready. Tons and tons of glass on the wall too for the mirror. But how cool is this right here? Big, big tub. I've heard people refer to this as the uh, Vegas car wash shower because it's, it's huge. You even could set up the TV, just relax. Enjoy life. Real quick, one more time so you can see the counters. Again, same cabinetry as in the kitchen. Into this master closet. Again, they need to fix the lights. They're kind of dim in here. But watch how big this is. This closet is almost as big as some of the rooms. If it didn't have the cutout right here, and that went flush, this would be a bedroom. This is huge. So let's head down, just so you can see the, uh, the outside. But before we do, real quick, sneak out here. So again, it's nice, you can come out to the balcony through the master or just open up that huge wall. Again, since where we're located, you're kind of tucked in here with the hills. So it's another new community going up right here, but you get all of these nice mountain views. Let's head down really quickly. Again, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. All of my description or all of my info is in the description down below. I can show you models, I can show you resales, whatever you would like to come out here and view. So again, with the new construction, you won't get the completed backyard. It will be dirt you will get the covered patio. And right over there by the barbecue, you do get a barbecue stud. So if you have a gas grill that accepts natural gas, you can hook it right up to that. But 
very nice size again this is a smaller lot they do have larger lots that you could put a pretty decent sized pool on them i've seen them but how neat is this home especially this kitchen hope you enjoyed this tour time with tyler again i really enjoyed this hope you're having fun with it feel free to give me a call until then i'll see you on the next one thank you and stay safe